One. Hi, my name is Anik and I'm Jordan. Welcome to the Physics Girl. Today, we're going to learn about speed and acceleration. First, we are going to look at Anik traveling at constant speed on the e-scooter. Using motion tracking software, we can draw three graphs. The distance time graph at the top, the speed time graph in the middle, and the acceleration time graph in the bottom. You can see that the distance time graph at the top is a straight diagonal line. This means it has a constant gradient. The gradient of a distance time graph is the speed. Therefore, this shows that Anik is moving at a constant speed. This is confirmed by the speed time graph shown in the middle, which shows he is moving at a constant speed. When an object is at constant speed, the acceleration should be zero. And this is demonstrated by the bottom graph, where the acceleration is shown to be zero. Now, let's compare this to when Anik is moving at a faster constant speed. You can see that the graphs don't change very much. The first graph still is a straight diagonal line. However, the gradient is now steeper. This shows that he is moving more distance per unit time. And therefore, he is moving with a faster constant speed. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed the show.